थ्री एट इज वॉट यस इंपैक्ट पैरामीटर दैट इज इन लेमेंस लैंग्वेज इंपैक्ट ऑफ कुलिजन देर इज वन व्हीकल वन ऑब्जेक्ट इट इज एट रेस्ट अनदर ऑब्जेक्ट मूविंग अलॉन्ग द सेम लाइन दैट मीन्स अलॉन्ग द लाइन ज्वाइनिंग द सेंटर ऑफ द टू सच टाइप ऑफ कुलिजन इज नोन एज हेड ऑन कुलिजन If two vehicles collide head-on, the damage impact is a maximum. If the particle is not moving along this line, then suppose particle is moving along this line, it will hit this particle. Say, let me draw this size to this one, to new height, new level. It will collide. but impact of collision will be less this perpendicular distance d is known as impact parameter in this case first one head on collision b is equal to 0 for head on collision so when b is a zero impact is maximum other way around lower the value of impact parameter higher is the impact effect as this distance increases the impact decreases <coughs> so as per definition impact parameter is the perpendicular distance of what initial velocity this is the initial velocity say you of alpha particle from the center of a nucleus if b is a small alpha particle suffers large deflection and the formula is yes b is equal to yes 1 by 4 pi epsilon not other parameter is what z and e z small e square capital e represents energy and cot Right. Examples. If b is a zero, that means we are talking about this case. Then it represents what? Cot theta by two is also zero. It means what? Tangent theta by two is what? Infinity. Tangent of what angle is infinity? Ninety. So theta by two is equal to pi by two. Means what? Theta is equal to pi or one eighty degree. Means what? Yes. If b zero means what? If there is a nuclei, alpha particle undergoes head-on collision, then particle will retrace its. path will undergo maximum deviation of what angle 180 degree so the relationship the b is what impact parameter theta is what deflection when b is zero theta is 180 degree z represents number of protons charge e is charge of one electron 1.6 in tens per minus 19 e is energy of a striking particle alpha particle in this case time with you is 3 minutes to write refer to numerical number 2 page 8 by 
numerical is an alpha particle is scattered through an angle of 10 degree on passing through a thin foil of copper z equal to 29 if energy of the particle is 5 mega electron volt what is impact parameter given is what yes z is equal to what 29 energy 5 mega electron volt 5 into 10 raised power 6 into 1.6 into 10 raised power minus 19 joule theta yes 10 degree you have to find out what you have to find out b formula for b is what yes b is equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught value please 9 into 10 power 9 z 29 e 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 divided by e e comes out to what 8 5 into 1.6 8 into 10 raised to power minus 19 and 6 minus 13 cot theta 10 by 2 cot 10 degree by 2 data cot 5 degree is yes what was the value 11.4 use this data cot 5 degree is 11.4 Calculate and confirm the answer is 0 0.95, 0 0.95 into 10 to the power minus 13, yes, SI units meter, 2 minutes with you, 2 minutes for calculation. Refer to B part, question number 3 B part. Distance of a closest approach distance of closest approach what you have is a nuclei with what charge plus z e that is the number of protons and you fire one alpha particle alpha particle is having charge plus how much plus 2 e you fire this with certain speed say u this initial distance is infinity that is very large distance infinity means very large in comparison to nuclear dimension even if it is few meters it is infinity as this alpha particle moves on head on collision b is equal to 0 it as it moves its speed will increase or decrease decrease why positive positive repulsion is there so it will have breaking effect this nuclei is part of gold foil number of trillions of atoms are in a single unit so it also experiences a force of a repulsion but it won't move why because gold foil is a fixed structure so as it moves towards 
speed decreases. After some time, what we observe is speed decreases 100, 50, 30, 20, 10, 0. When speed is 0, yes, it will turn back because this positive charge will repel. So, this distance D is termed as distance of a closest approach. This is what we want to find out. If this is to be termed as initial position, this is the final position or you can say this is position 1, this is position 2. Yes, what are the energies involved? Kinetic and electric potential energy at 1. Yes, step 1. Total energy at 1 is kinetic energy at 1 plus electric potential energy at 1. Kinetic energy at 1 is what? 1 by 2 m u square. We may write as k in future. Electric potential energy, yes, Q1, Q2, Q1, Q2 over 4 pi epsilon naught distance. Distance is what? Infinity. So, this parameter is what? 0. Step 2. At this point, as it moves 150, 30, 20, 10, 0. When it is 0, what is its kinetic energy? 0. Total energy at 2 is kinetic energy at 2 plus electric potential energy at 2. Kinetic energy at 2 is 0. Electric potential energy at 2 is Ze, 2E divided by 4 pi epsilon naught. Distance between the two is what? D. If you term this as equation number 1, this as equation number 2, step 3 is what? Law of conservation of energy. Total energy at 1 is equal to total energy at 2. This kinetic energy, if I term this kinetic energy as K, 1 by 2 mu square is equal to Z e into 2 e over 4 pi epsilon naught d. What we want to find out is d, d is equal to what? Yes, Z e into 2 e divided by 4 pi epsilon naught into k. This is the formula. For this particular experiment performed by Rutherford, various values given were, yes, z is equal to what? Yes, if you put this data, z is equal to what? 79. If you put energy equal to what? Yes, 7 point mega electron volt. This is 29, E is 1.6 in times power minus 19, 1.6 in times power minus 19, 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught is known to you, 9 times power 9. K is given in mega electron volt, you need to change it, mega is times power 6, electron volt is 1.6 in times power minus 19. When you put all these values, then what you get is, yes, comes out to be what? D comes out to be what? On solving this, it is given in the derivation. Approximately 3 into 10 raised to power minus 14 meter. This is what is important. Nucleus size is of what order? 10 raised to the power minus 14. This radius is of order 10 raised to power minus 14, which is equal to what? 10 raised to the power minus 4 times, this is 10 raised to the power minus 4 times the radius of a atom. Time with you is 4 minutes to write.
you can refer to numerical number one. Numerical number one. Numerical number one is in a head on collision between an alpha particle and gold nucleus, minimum distance of approach is 4 into 10 raised power minus 14 meter. Calculate the energy of alpha particle, take z is equal to 79. Given is what? Yes. Distance of closest approach, how much? Minus 14 meters. What else? Z, 79. You have to find out what? Kinetic energy, K, you have to find out. Kinetic energy, K, you have to find out. This is the formula to be used. K is equal to Z E into 2e over 4 pi epsilon naught d. In this formula, we can put up the values as it is. Z, how much? 79. Then 2, e is power 1, e is power 1, e is power 2, 1.6 into 10 raised to the power minus 19 power 2. 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught, 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught, this value is, you should write it here, 9 into 10 raised to the power 9. What about D? Yes, 4 into 10 raised to the power minus 14. You will get this answer in joule. Find the answer in joule first. K is equal to how many joule? Then we will change it to mega electron volt. Find it in joule. What is the answer in joules? Yes. Nine, approximately nine into ten is power minus a thirteen joule. How many of you are getting this answer? Nine into ten is power minus thirteen. Say k is approximately this, but we want kinetic energy k in terms of electron volt. Yes, the relationship. 1 electron volt is 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 joule. So, 1 joule is what? 1 over 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19, so many electron volts into 10 to the power 6 electron volt. 10 to the power 6 electron volt is what? Yes, mega electron volt. It comes out to what? 5.6? So, kinetic energy is equal to approximately 5.6 mega electron volt. 